Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, hashtag Teacher Angel. Today I will be sharing with you how to create number one stories. Are you ready? Great! But before that, let's have a recall first of what are number bonds. Number bonds is a model that represents the relationship between the total and the parts. Look at this. Number bonds of 6. So let's think of pairs of numbers that make up a 6. Okay, 5 and 1 make 6. Can you help me? Think of another pair of numbers. Great job! 4 and 2 make 6. Another. Yes, 0 and 6 make 6. So if we add 5 and 1, let's say you have 5 fingers and 1 more finger, the total is 6. Very good. Alright, now let's try this. What can you see? Yes, blocks. What colors? Blue blocks and pink blocks. Oh, what do you notice? Yes, number 10 is written on the blue block. And the pink blocks, there is a missing number, right? Now help me find the other pair. Okay, let's start with 10 and 2. What is a number that you can add? to 8 to make 10. Yes, it's 8. What about 10 and 5? The total is 10. And there's 5. What's the missing number? What's the other part? Yes, it's 5. Very good. 5 fingers plus 5 fingers is equal to 10. Good job. What about this? 1 plus a number. 1 finger how many more fingers so that it will become 10 look at your two hands you have the fingers right so you already have one to make it 10 great you need nine good job what about 10 and 7 what's the other part so that it will become 10 okay show me your seven fingers how many more do you need to make it 10 Wow, it's three. Very good. The next one, ten and nine. Nine plus a number. Yeah, it's one. Oh, teacher angel, it's really one because it's just like the same as one and nine. And the other one is nine and one. Oh yeah, very good observation. The order of the addends or the two numbers that we add were just exchange. Right? So you know what, children, in math we call that commutative property. The order of the addends were interchanged or exchanged, but the total is still the same. 9 plus 1 is 10. 1 plus 9 is 10. Very good. Okay, 10. One part is 0. What is the other part? Very good, 10. 0 plus 10 makes 10. You know what, kids? There is also another property of addition. That when you add the number to 0, the answer is the number itself. Like 10 is the number added to 0, 10 plus 0, the answer is still the number. It's 10. Very good. Now, I know some of you thought of another technique to get the other parts. Who among you here use subtraction? Yes, you are right. We can use subtraction to get the other parts. Just like 10 minus 2 gives you 8. 10 minus 1 gives you 9. So children, because addition and subtraction, they are opposite operations. They are related to each other. Okay, you can use addition to check your answer in subtraction and use subtraction to, change, to check the answer in addition. They are opposite operation. Okay, children, I think you are now ready to create your own number bonds stories. Are you ready to make your own stories? Okay, but I will be helping you first. Let's have this example. 
fill in the number bond and the blanks to complete the number story. How many red chairs can you see? Great! There are three red chairs. What about this? Yes, there are how many brown chairs? Two brown chairs. So how many chairs are there in all? Yay! There are five! There are five chairs in all. Okay, one more example. Look at this. How many math books are there? Count with me. One, two, three, four. Very good. There are four math books. What about this? How many science books are there? Okay, three. There are three science books. And so, what is the total? Or how many books are there altogether? Great! There are seven books altogether. Now, I think you are ready to answer the activity posted in your CISO account. Week 3 Number Stories, Number Bond Stories. I think you are ready to answer that. So, these are the pages that you can see. You have story number 1. Okay, fill in the number bond and the blanks to complete the number story. Story number two. And the challenge is for story number three. So you can make your own number story here. You can draw in the illustrations or you can put some pictures or drawings. And don't forget to write the total in all. Okay, that's it for today. I hope you like this video. If you like the video, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, hashtag Teacher Angel. Thank you for listening. God bless you all.